Organizers of the Brainerd JCs are investigating whether some competitors in this year's $150,000 ice fishing extravaganza engaged in fraud. The Minneapolis Star Tribune reports three of the 150 prize winners in the January 27th contest are being investigated to make sure their fish were caught legitimately. Event chairman Shane Meyer told the Star Tribune organizers have no proof of cheating, but they've placed holds on all three prizes as the investigation is pending. Stefan Lyoski and his father Ivan Lyoski caught two of the three northern pike that won prizes. A relative, Rostick, caught the sole perch. The men finished in first, third, and 98th place, respectively. Their prizes were a pickup truck, $1,000, and an ice auger. They've all been placed on hold. A lawyer for the men said that they followed contest rules and are willing to take lie detector tests. Winning anglers who don't take a test upon request must forfeit their prizes. Volunteers patrol the area on Gull Lake where anglers can fish, but with an estimated 12,000 participants this year, monitoring can be difficult. It could be possible for someone to sneak in a fish into the area, though fish must be alive when registered to qualify for a prize. It would also be possible for a participant to sneak a fish into a hole the night before the competition. Organizers plan to have additional security protocols next year and say only two other anglers have been investigated for cheating over the event's 28 years. In those two cases, one person took a required lie detector test and passed it, and the other person declined, which was his right. When he did, though, he forfeited his prize. The event has raised more than $3.3 million for charities since its founding. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.